WFF 48 Shamiriel Ratliff joins us now live in Huntsville. Shamiriel, agents say they were hoping to send a message with these busts. Kim, they are, and that message is stopped right now. A new law that was passed by the state put spice in the same category as heroin, and stack officers say get rid of it now or face the consequences. It's one of the biggest busts we've seen. I was going over here to buy cigarettes, and I looked, and here's all these policemen. I thought, Lord, has he been robbed again? He's been robbed about three times. The store wasn't robbed, it was raided. More than 1,000 grams of spice lie on the floor after stack agents paid Mooney's Grocery and Beverages a visit Monday afternoon. There's been other store owners, but he was really the best one of all of them. He was just really nice, he fit into the neighborhood, and he's really a good guy. And I didn't know anything about all the rest that I don't know anything about nothing like it. But stack agents did. The state has a new law that bans the synthetic substance. The state of Alabama has uh, has said that we no longer want this product whatsoever in our state and, and we're bound to deal with it. So we're, we're going to put a stop to it. The raid led to the store owner's arrest who didn't have time to turn off the open sign. That proved to be a tease for some shoppers who were greeted with locked doors. With a successful sting, stack agents warn any other stores who are selling spice to stop. We're very aggressive and strictly enforcing the new spice law that has been passed by the state uh, legislature here recently. Uh, it's clearly a problem and uh, we're, we're out to try to put a stop to it as quickly as possible. Stack agents say if you're selling spice at your store to call them immediately and they will come get it for you, you will not face any charges. Reporting live in Huntsville, Shamiriel Ratliff, WAFF 48 News.